Hi, this is Jerry with I Love RV Life. Do you have a dual or triple axle fifth wheel or camper and you're tired of that movement, that shaking? I've got a brand new product I want to share with you. These are RV wheel stabilizers, axle stabilizers. And you'll want to stay tuned to the end of this video. I've got a surprise for you. Hi, this is Jerry. Uh, if you have a dual axle or triple axle, fifth wheel or camper, you'll know when you walk around you get that vertical shaking front and back uh, and especially a fifth wheel when you have those steps and you have that extra stepping action, you'll actually feel that fifth wheel uh, shake just a bit. And this is even more common if you have uh, a unit like Joan and I have that does not have the uh, what I call six point stabilizers. We just have a jack in the front and then jacks in the back that stabilize the fifth wheel. And you can get a lot of motion going front and back, especially when you go up the steps, you'll feel that. Well, I've got a brand new product here that was sent to me by Epo Artist. And um, it's called, it's there, you'll see this here in the back box and I'll open this up for you a second. They call this the Super Heavy Duty Series. These things weigh 10 pounds. The uh, construction of these are really substantial. And before we uh, open the box and go outside, you'll want to stay tuned to the end. I'm going to share with you how you can get a set of these for free. Well, let's open up the box here. And again, these things are, are, are a bit heavy. They're quite substantial. Comes with everything that you need. Everything that you need here. You've got this uh, nice ratchet um, that you'll see me use in just a few minutes to set these things. And then I'll pull these out. I'll pull one out. And they, like I said, they are a bit heavy. And you'll see uh, these things are made of solid steel. I, I'm not sure if this is a powder coating. They say that they're rust free. And then literally you put these things between your wheels and, uh, and you jack them out like so. And it puts pressure on the two wheels and keeps that movement from going. Now, these units, uh, I do not consider them a chalk replacement. Some people may want to do that. I, I don't. Um, one of the things that I do is when we pull into the campground, I set my chocks, one in the front, one in the back, before I ever, ever disconnect the fifth wheel. I can't tell you the horror stories that I've seen in campgrounds where someone forgot to do it, we're on a slight incline and off they roll. You don't want to do that. The second thing too is oh, I put my chocks down front and back and then I'll take these units. They, they have a nice, nice carrying handle that comes with them. I, I like that. Um, put them between the tires and then you know, then I take the ratchet and I put just really good firm pressure. You don't want to go too far, but you want to put nice uh, firm pressure on the wheels to keep any of that movement from going on and uh, and they work really really fantastic then I uncouple from my truck uh, because once in a while if you're on a bit of a shift uh, without the without these in place and you're on a slight incline you'll feel the camper actually go a little bit and um, I mean these things are just absolutely fantastic again uh, the whole box probably weighs roughly about 10 pounds very very substantially made let's uh let's go outside and i'll just show you how super easy it is to set these things in your camper and then um, stay tuned and i'll tell you how you can get a set for free so first thing i'll do i'll, I'll do a, a bit of a pre-fit here and just kind of get them in the center of the tire that's important and then finger tighten them a little bit take the wrench And you'll typically start hearing your leaf springs pop just a little bit. I'll give it a couple good little pops. Watch it look for just a slight indention in the wheel. And you can look, there is absolutely zero movement. And I'm going to put everything I've got in here. And there is no movement in this at all. And I'll put one of these on the front and one on the back. And you can see it's a good tight fit. They're not going anywhere. And we are ready to go. The other thing I want you to notice as well is that uh, I still use my chocks, one in the front, and I also use one back here in the back. And that way I, uh, I know this isn't gonna go anywhere. And then just as easy uh, to take off. I'm gonna reverse this, grab it by the handle. Pop 
pack them up, and we're ready to go home. This is a really nice product. There's almost a precision to them. The, uh, the action inside of them is very, very nice. Uh, and then they give you a good firm fit up against the wheels. And then this wrench that they supply is uh, long enough that you don't bust your knuckles. Well, I contacted Epo Art and said, these things are really nice, uh, but I would like to give them away to the I Love RV Life viewers. And they said, please do. So I think the easiest way to do this is go to ilovervlife.com. And in the top right hand side of the page, uh, under the big picture, you'll see a place to subscribe to the I Love RV Life newsletter. And we send this out every Saturday morning. And for any existing newsletter subscribers or any new email subscribers that we receive, then you will go into a big pot and then I will do a drawing. I will contact you uh, by email. You'll need your first name, last name, and a valid email address so that I can contact you. And I'll drop you an email and say, hey, you won. And uh, then all I'll need to do is you to email me back, give me a phone number, let me give you a ring, and uh, uh, we'll need a shipping address so I can send it to you anywhere here in the United States. Epoart provided these. I'm going to pick up the freight and send them to you so it won't cost you a dime. And uh, just my thanks to you for being an I Love RV Life subscriber. If you want to keep receiving those newsletters uh, on a Saturday morning basis, I appreciate you receiving those. But look, um, we try to make things simple here. If you don't want to receive them, that's okay. You can always go to the bottom, do one click, and you'll be unsubscribed and you won't receive any more. But again, I think you'll like the newsletter and I definitely know you're gonna like these. Look, these are really designed for people with twin axle or triple axle campers or fifth wheels. If you've got a class A, I don't know that these will work as well for you or a class C, I don't know if it'll work as well for you. But um, again, I, I would love to be able to send these to you. And I really appreciate EpoArt providing these to us to be able to look at and review. That was very kind of them. We enjoy looking at this. I'll provide links on Amazon to where you can actually buy these. Uh, so you'll be able to see that here in the description of this YouTube video. Or you can go to ilovervlife.com and go to the blog for this product and you'll see how to purchase it as well. Um, very, very nice. I think very reasonably priced. And uh, I think you'll enjoy using these and, and getting rid of that forward and backward shift that you often feel in your camper. So great product. Uh, I thank Epoart again for supplying these. And um, we enjoy reviewing these products. Many times we purchase products ourselves, and then on occasion we get something from a manufacturer as well. And we like sharing that with our RV community of, uh, of viewers. And we appreciate your views so much. Subscribe if you get a chance. And uh, thanks. We love doing this. Yeah, and we love RV life too.